Hello and welcome back everybody. This is St. Jimmy25 and after a month and a half away, basically on some vacation, just doing some regular work like an everyday person, I'm back everybody and I'm doing something absolutely, I don't know how crazy it's going to be, but it's kind of dumb in my opinion. I am soloing um, Phasmophobia. If you don't know, Phasmophobia, there's a video of it, um, of me and my friend Ben playing that's on the channel already. It is a ghost hunting co-op game, is what um, it is. So basically you and up to four, and up to three friends, so a total of four people, can go to these haunted locations. You gotta figure out, using evidence, what kind of ghost is in that location. And that's uh, what we're gonna do here today. But um, to really give it a twist, I'm doing it by myself, which is really terrifying, because this thing has just this game gets you. It's got the key to the house. I'm just doing it on the basic starter level, the one house, one floor house, Tanglewood. Has a basement, but hopefully it's not down there. And I'm also doing it on professional, which is just absolutely ridiculous because I have no setup time. The thing can hunt me as soon as I walk in. So that's where we're at, everybody. Let's go. Carol Williams. Doesn't matter if she's alone or not. I'm by myself. Dirty water photo and uh, ghost event. Oh, good, good. Uh, let's grab our strong flashlight. You can carry three items with you at a time. I always go with your strong flashlight so you can see. You got a thermometer. Find the ghost room really quickly. And then once we do find the ghost room, I will take a ghost book. We don't really need the motion sensors right now because it's not an optional objective, so it's not really necessary. So when I scroll over to my thermometer, you notice my flashlight's not there anymore. You can hit T and your flashlight comes on. So you just hit T and your flashlight comes on. This gives you a bunch of information. I won't really get to use it much unless I come back out, which I will a couple of times. Sanity is very, very important, so we do have sanity pills over here. Uh, let's go. Let's go find Carol. This thing's so creepy. The deafening silence. <sighs> what am I doing? Get some lights on in here. It's always listening, so I'm going to be a little bit quiet. I don't want it to hunt me right off the bat. Oh, there's the bone. Oh, there we go. Okay, so I'll take a picture of that later. Oh, she's here. Hello, Carol. In the dining room. Oh, footstep. Okay, let's go get some evidence. Stuff. Oh, my goodness. God, it's always freaking... Woo! It's so terrifying in there by yourself. Oh, my God. Okay, so yeah, so look at that. She's already active when I get near her. Which tells us a couple of things. There's a couple like Onis and Jins that are really, really active when you get near them. And then it dies when you leave, which is kind of what we're seeing here. And I know you guys didn't get here, but he did say there was a report of light switching, which is a Jin kind of thing. So this gives me Jin vibes right off the bat. And so let's go ahead and get us a. Um, crucifix because I don't want to die right off the bat. Hey, um, video camera, we're going to turn that on real quick and put it on the tripod so we can get stuff set up and look for some orbies. And the crucifix is so that I don't die right off the bat. So here we go. over here. She has not written in the book yet. That's going to go there. 
get this crucifix down. So that gives you a three meter, six diameter radius. I do need to turn off the light so I can see. Ooh, creak with that. Oh, she touched the door. Oh, she closed the basement door, okay. I didn't open it, but she did touch the basement door, I think. And so with that, yeah, it's very, very territorial. It's giving me Jin and Oni vibes right off the bat. I don't have to check for fingies. Look at that thing. Look at that activity meter right there. And now it's dead. I left and it's dead. This is so Jin like Okay, orbs. Show me orbs. Oh! She moved that. Did you see that? Does that count as a customer? No. Okay, it could be a poltergeist, but that would be orbs as well. But I think this is more gin than anything. Knock that again, Carol. Oh! Jesus! Did you see that? <laughs> Ooh, that gets the blood boiling. I can't see if she wrote in my book yet, though. Oh, but no orbs, and she's right there. That sucks. Oh, she's active. Oh my god, is she active. Oh, it, she manifested somewhere. Holy butt, she is super act Okay, it's just ramped up. Okay, it's not really an effect to me, but man, she is like, hey, hey, get back in here. I want to kill you. I want to fucking kill you. Oh, this is terrifying. <laughs> but yeah, we should have seen the ghost orb, so no orbies, huh? I have no evidence yet. Hmm. But I can say that there's no orb, so it can't be... It could be an Oni. I'd have to get in there, but it'd have to write for me. Uh, it could be a demon if they go freezing temps, but I haven't seen one yet. Revenant. Jesus fucking Christ. But it doesn't look like a djinn, even though it's acting like a djinn, because I don't see orbs. Hmm. Activity's died off. She just had herself a little spike is all. Gonna take a UV light. We get another crucifix in there so I don't fucking die. Check sanity. Because sanity is the most important thing. They can't hunt right now. We're golden on sanity. Ooh, why am I doing this to myself? Fingies! You see that, guys? We have fingerprints on that door. Alright, I'm gonna get out for a second. Because I do not like being alone. The ghosts, they, they just terrify me when I'm alone. I'm sorry, this is how it is. <laughs> Woo, this game will get you. Wow, and the activity spiked right up. But yes, we have fingies. That is our first piece of evidence, which we will put in our journal. And there it is, fingerprint. So it could be a spirit, a wraith, a poltergeist, a banshee, or a revenant. Oh my gosh. Uh, the wraith could be something. Can't be an oni, because we got fingies. Or a demon, or a uri, which is kind of nice. I'm really worried about the revenant. If it attacks, whew, fuck, I'm dead. So hopefully it doesn't write for me. Uh, hopefully it's just a spirit. Give me a poltergeist, it is moving that shit all over the place. But we need Orbeez, and I don't see any Orbeez. I have to check that book. And maybe put another camera at a different angle. Hmm. Alright. Oh, I forgot the other crucifix. That's fine, that's fine. We can grab this. And this is why I brought two of these. Oh, activities up. Where did you touch that door? Wait for it to die down. Alright, uh, right, let's go in there. Sanity, good. Okay. We gotta stay sane, everybody. That's the way to avoid a hunt. She may manifest herself and stuff, but she can't hunt me if I'm at 90 sanity. She put that on the ground. one over here. Oh, freezing temps! Hopefully that's a good spot. 
So we have freezing tempies. Put that over there. No ghost writing, but I'm going to bring another book over here. She might be in this area. So I'll be right back. Creaky creak. And safe. Whew. Once you get out of the house, you're safe. It cannot come out here and hunt you. So, whew. Okay. Okay, so that's another piece of object. Freezing temp, so it's not a revenant. Thank goodness it's not a revenant. Alright, we should be able to figure this out. Um... Oh yeah, over here, Freezing Tempies. A Wraith or a Banshee. Great! So one is going to be EMF-5, and the other, I believe, is Orb. Yeah, EMF-5 is the Banshee. The Wraith is Spirit Box. I haven't heard it stim stomping, so it might be a Wraith. Oh, I didn't turn the lights off in there. Fuck. Oh yeah, it's not going to be Orbs anyway. It's a Wraith or Banshee. Okay, Sandy's fine. I don't think Ghost Riding's one. No, it's EMF and Spirit Box. So we're going to grab the Spirit Box. And we're going to find out right now what this bitch is. To do that, I have to turn the lights off, which is fun. Are you here? Are you here? Are you here? Where are you? How old are you? Nothing. Okay. I don't think it's spirit boxy. So it's probably a banshee. Great. I'm gonna go with that and I'm getting out of here. Such a lot of stuff. It didn't um, talk to me on the spirit box. I didn't really do it that long. It could be a shy banshee. Man. Woo. <sighs> Dirty water she hasn't done yet. I'm not taking a photo of the ghost. That's fucking ridiculous. Uh, I'm going banshee, everybody. I guess I should do a sweep with the therma uh, with the EMF real quick. To be thorough. But I have to get a five. Fuck that. Fuck this, I hate it. I hate all of this. This is crazy. Ridiculous. I'm not going to get all the monies for this. I don't like doing solo. But yeah, I'm pretty darn sure it's a Banshee. And we're going to put that in um, here. We don't even need the third thing. We're just going for it. We got the bone. We got a little extra money. But yeah, it's a Banshee. Alright guys, that was so much fun. Thank you so much for watching. We'll catch you in the next one. St. Jimmy 25 out. Love y'all so much. Uh, don't forget to like this video, share it, and subscribe for me, please. Because, man. Alright. Hey, we got it right. Look at us go. But yes, please subscribe. It helps out. Free to you. Free. That's the thing. It takes two seconds. Click the button. Subscribe. Hit a like. It's great. It helps the video. And I'll make more of this crazy stuff, and I'll do better next time with the, um, soloing. Maybe I'll get a little less nervous. But I actually have to go to my real work now, so I'm out. Love y'all. Take care. St. Jimmy 25 out.